about somebody getting their head chopped off, man. That's right. What? Huh. I will mop when your fear coming. Right, we're gonna mop when your fear coming. That's why when we send our videos of people getting judged, people get ran over, yep. we laugh. Fine. Because that's what you get, man. That's right. A lot of our people are wicked, man. They need to be put to death. Yep. Okay? A lot of our people, our people need to be judged, man. Because the issues come from the issues of death come from the Heavenly Father. That's right, man. That's why we understand death. Matter of fact, give me that real quick. Uh, Psalms uh, 68. It's the book of Psalms. Chapter 68, verse 20. And it reads, He that is our power is the power of salvation, and unto the Most High the Lord belong the issues from death. Right, unto the Most High Lord belong the issues of death, man. All right, the, when, whenever somebody dies, the Lord calls that, whether it's a stillborn baby, whether it's an 80 year old getting judged, whether it's a middle aged person getting judged. The Lord did that, man. The Lord put people to death, man. Real quick, Smike, third race, one grab. Uh, Job uh, 14 and 4. No, it's like a Job 4 and uh, 5. Chapter 4. It's like a 4 and 7. 4 and 7. For like Job! Chapter 4, verse 7. Man, that's the type of stuff. People just driving across parking lots, man. It's a sidewalk. Man. A sidewalk? That's a sidewalk. It's like a parking lot. I'm a sidewalk, man. Just went right up there. There's a stairwell, a building right here. They just going across the damn sidewalk, man. That's a that's a heavy ticket because this is an area of pedestrians, man. That's weird. Bro, that's, that's the type of behavior that is perpetuated in America, man. People are doing whatever they feel like whenever they want to do it, man. If I can say something real quick, man, it just goes to show you not the, not gonna harp on the two beat, but I mean shit, like people got a microwave mentality, man. You know what I'm saying? Dude had to go up the street up there. He drove down here to go off the sidewalk and go up there. You know what I'm saying? When I mean this is a one-way street. But it just goes to show you, man, these people are insane, bro. People are out of control, man. That's why we need a higher power to be that we we need order and judgment, man. You know what I'm saying? People just driving off the sidewalks, man. It takes you a minute, probably a minute and 30 seconds to go around the block the right way. You couldn't go a minute and 30 seconds, you had to cut, cut across the damn sidewalk with people walking, man. But that's exactly what Esau wants, man. That's how that chip is going gonna, is gonna to be uh, like a, a piece of gold to the people, man. Because they're so lazy now, they don't want to count change, no one, nobody want to count, don't nobody want to use their brain for anything, man. So that chip is going to be right up there, Courtesy. You know? Like I said, just people are just real jerks, man. Just, just on a day-to-day -day basis, man, people are real jerks, man. Look at you crazy, you know? Just just people thinking they can do anything. You can't do any and everything you want to, man. Like the brother's going into perfectly, like the scriptures explain. You being judged for that, man. 2016, people are being killed on spot. Snapchat, Facebook, down the street, the news, upstairs, around the corner, your neighborhood. This, see, it's not, it's not this so far off imaginary thing no more. It's not just going on in the hood. No, it's going on down the street at a restaurant. Some distraught person who just who like the hell with it, man, and go all the way in because the Lord put that vengeance, put that spirit on the people that had that vengeance. That's right. That's right. That's right. Somebody want to hold uh, uh, 33 on that one. Okay. 29. I'm still holding Joe. Yeah, Joe. Just to just to land back on what the brother said about people. You got people out here, they're, every day they're eating McDonald's, Burger King, uh, microwave meals, and that destroys your cognitive thinking. You don't have no ability to be thinking about what's going on around you. And you'll see people just driving on the highway just looking at their phone. Or you'll see people doing this type of stuff right here. Just not paying no attention and not being able to see and recognize that this ain't no street. It's a big ass sign in the middle of it. That should tell you right there. But these people's mind is gone, far off and thinking to whatever they want to think. That's right. And the world is just their playground, as they say. They got blinders on to reality, man. They, they create, everyone's creating their own reality. <laughs> they see so, man. Everybody's right. living their own little BS world, man. That's right. Where they, where they the king, and, uh -huh. and they, they the, 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 the shit, and all this, man. They can do whatever, but not knowing that you a piece of crap, man. Yeah. You a worthless piece of skin, man. You, you, you take it up oxygen, man. That's right. A lot of our people have negative worth on walking on the planet Earth right now, man. But in their mind, they the best thing since sliced bread. You know? 
Okay. You'll have the same person, not to keep going. You'll have the same person drive off the street, hit somebody, he'll try to sue the city for not making it clear, you know, that that's not a, a street. Yeah. That's the type of world that we live in. Yeah, I'm trying to make loopholes and get around stuff instead of just taking yeah. responsibility for your actions. Yeah. Job chapter 4, verse 7. Remember, I pray thee, whoever perish being innocent. Right, so whoever perish being innocent, man. If you got put to death, man, and no one's innocent, we are all worthy of death, man. So if you die, that was your judgment. And that's why we, we, we don't laugh, man. When you get hit by a, a, a semi-truck, get rolled uh, 27 times. Hey, that's funny. That's what you get, man. Okay? There was one chick uh, a few years back, uh, she was riding on a motorcycle, it was so bad on World Star Hip Hop, her, her leg was uh, ripped off. You know what I'm saying? It was from a knee, kneecap on down, it was twisted that way, but the leg was still straight. And she's in the middle of the street, she just, she was in so much pain, she was like, shit, you could tell on her face she was then about to pass out. That's what she get, bad thing is she was cute with some little ass shorts on, man. That's right. Oh, I remember. Yeah, got her, got her toe, damn the toe off, man. That's what you get, man. We, we don't have no sympathy for people getting put to death because it came from the Heavenly Father, man. And this is a sinful, sinful place that's walking around here. And more death and more warranted death is going to come to America. And it's going to ultimately end up in America's destruction, man. That's right, that's right. Because of what is perpetuated across the whole earth and what, the, what America has done to the nation of Israel, man. The true Israelites. Okay, like I said, you so called Negroes, Latinos, and Native Americans. Okay, the Edomites, who's the so called white man, who's the Edomite according to the Bible, have put their hands on the Lord's, the apple of the Lord's eye, man. That's right. Slavery, rape, robbery, and murder. All right, unfair treatment until this very day, man. So America is going to burn for that, man. That's right. And it, like I said, it needs to burn, man. This place is nothing but a big cesspool where they say don't judge it, but all this wickedness is being perpetuated. But this is such a God-fearing country. A bunch of Christians walk around here, but there is no judgment, no righteous judgment going on in this place, man. This place needs to be judged, man. Right. Just to finish it off, or where were the righteous cut off? Right, where are the righteous cut off? Man, the righteous are never cut off, man. All right, but the wicked, they get their judgment, they get put to death, man. Like I said earlier, that's why I don't feel any type of way when you see all this mass death come around, man. People are marching and crying for, for these, uh, these jakes that are getting put to death, man, but they wasn't right. Like Trayvon Martin and uh, Eric Garner, the priest, they, they wouldn't follow the law, set the commandments of the Heavenly Father. He buying loose cigarettes, man. You buying cancer sticks. Mike Brown, he robbing people. And they don't justify the cops because they gonna get their judgment too. These Edomites gonna get judged too. Okay, because the scriptures say offenses may come, but woe to them that offenses come by. So the so-called white man is not gonna get away with it either, man. That's right. Go ahead. First Samuel chapter two, verse six. The Lord killeth and maketh a lie. The Lord killeth and maketh a lie, man. Real quick, uh, Isaiah 45 and 7. All right, the Lord killeth and the Lord maketh a lie, man. Like we've been going into for the past uh, few minutes. All right, the Most High is, is, if you die, it's because the Most High had a head out for you, man. All right, the Most High wanted to send you back to the spirit world. And, and that, that's crazy how people say God is all love, man, but God destroyed, flooded the whole earth with eight people. And it was rightfully so, man. He's going to do the yeah. same thing to America. He's going to burn America up, man. Right. And only deliver the elect of the nation of Israel out of it, man. God killed the Egyptians. All right, he drowned Pharaoh and all and all his company, man, for putting their hands on the Israelites, man. The Messiah is about balance. He's about love and hate. Okay, real quick, Isaiah 45 and 7. It's Isaiah chapter 45, verse 7. I form the light and create darkness. All right, he forms the light and creates darkness, man. The Mosai does both of those things. So all this turmoil around here, all these bad things that have happened, the Heavenly Father is the root of it, man. Right. Like there's a documentary, uh, I don't know if y'all remember that, when that tornado hit Oklahoma back in like, 2013, where it just decimated the middle of Oklahoma. There's a documentary talking about where was God. God was all in that, baby. Yeah. He was right. all in that wreaking havoc. That's right. Tearing stuff up, man. It was furniture moving because the Heavenly Father won and he ordained it, man. That's right. Go ahead. God says, I create, I make peace and create evil. He makes peace and create evil. So all this turmoil and why people can't get together and everybody's about love each other, but it's just some, some reason it's just not working. The Heavenly Father ain't with it, man. He's about division. He's about all this race rising, all this turmoil that's going on here in America, man. The Heavenly Father's stirring all this up for an eventual big race war. 
we're just gonna end up to uh, martial law, right. concentration camps, to uh, to chip, to the chip coming, man, and, and ultimately to the uh, world, third world's war, to where America will be completely decimated in other parts of the world, but the whole world is not gonna be destroyed, man, contrary to popular belief. All right, it's gonna be a new rulership, the true the rulers under the who the world enemy calls Jesus Christ. His elect men of the nation of Israel are going to rule, man, forever, according to the scriptures. Yeah. He says, uh, I, the Lord, do all these things. Right, and he further qualifies. He said, I, the Lord, do all these things, man. Anything and everything that goes around, uh, that, that moves, that happens, the Heavenly Father has ordained all of them, man. We went to that last week, man, how the most high is in complete control. Right? Yeah, I got some Deuteronomy 32 and 39. See now that I, even I, am he, and there is no power with me. I kill and I make alive. Right. This is the heavenly father Yahweh talking, man. He says there is no other power but him, man. There is no other creator but Yahweh. All right? Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shah, man. There's only one power that, that's orchestrating this scene, man. There ain't no battle of, there's not no throne in the heavens of 20 gods and everybody's counseling together. No, there's a heavenly father and then he has his angels on the left hand and the right hand side all right that he that he issues out other orders for go ahead i wound and i heal he wounds and he heals man go ahead neither is there any that can deliver out of my hand right there's none that can deliver out of your hand man so people try to do these walk for cancers and do stem cell research and all this type of stuff trying to thwart the plans of the heavenly father it doesn't matter man the only way that your cancer goes into remission if the Most High allows it. Yep, right. But if the Most High wants to smoke you with cancer within three weeks, you out of there, man. Yep, right. But it's all for His purpose. Sometimes it's a stumbling block. Okay, especially for them church days, they do all that praying and they think that the Heavenly Father is with them, man, to keep them in that same mind state. Okay, it's all a stumbling block according to the Most High's will. If I can say something real quick, in the, uh, in the book of Job, the uh, the fourteenth chapter, it even tells you that the Most High has a determined time. When you when you supposed to go, you know what I'm saying. It goes down to the very to the very millisecond of millisecond when he knows you're gonna go, man. So if the Most High created everybody and everything, but the Most High isn't the one that's doing the killing, you know what I'm saying. He's not the one doing the killing, but he created you. But he loves everybody. He's just gonna sit back and uh, well, I'm, you know, no, I'm not about death. No, the Most High does all that, man. If he wants you to go, you're going to go. If he wants you to stay, you're going to stay. If you're going to get boxed tomorrow, you're going to get boxed tomorrow. If you're going to get shot, you're going to get shot. It's that simple, man. It tells you in the book of Proverbs, man. It's going it's up the Lord, man. You know what I'm saying? So if somebody comes down the street, or if a cop, for example, you know what I'm saying, shoots one of these jakes in the street, who ultimately was the one that did it? According to what the brother read in Job the fourth chapter, no man has ever perished being innocent. You know what I'm saying? It's all the most high at the end of the day, man. People... You know, it's a stumbling block, like the brother said, man, but it is what it is, you know? Yeah, we understand the Lord will we continue in this understanding, man. All right, the elect is going to understand and uh, go through it. You said no man's ever perished being innocent. Is that including your house shot? Uh, yeah. He actually paid for his own sins as well. That's right. That's solid. Yeah. Let's get it. Hebrews, Hebrews chapter 7. I got you. Yeah. You know, so because like I said, there, there was reincarnation in the Bible. So the Lord came as in the different carnations. Adam, he seen as Adam. He brought in uh, knowledge of wickedness. All right, he seen as uh, Solomon. He made uh, other gods to all his wives. Okay? So though, he had, he still had to pay for that. You know? Uh, real quick. I got you. Come on, man. 2 Samuel. You said uh, 7. You got it? Yeah. 7. 7. 12. 7. 12. 7. 12. Second Samuel chapter seven. Grab it real quick. I got it right here. Yeah. This is Second Samuel chapter seven, and I'll start at verse. I'll start at verse eleven. And as since the time that I commanded judges to be over my people Israel, and have caused thee to rest from all thy enemies, also the Lord telleth thee that He will make thee in house. All right, so talking to King David right here. And when thy days be fulfilled. And thou shalt sleep with thy fathers, I will set up thy seed after thee, which shall proceed out of thy bowels, and I will establish his kingdom. Right, set, set up thy seed, okay? At first it was talking about King Solomon, because he, he said he set him up, and King Solomon built the house, and he said he had 
Right? But then ultimately ends up to be in your house shot because he's the seed of David. He's the root and the offspring. Where? He shall build a house for my name, and I will establish the throne of his kingdom forever. Forever. Okay. Solomon built the, 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 the carnal house. Okay. Then your house shot, then the spirit is being built. We'll build a spiritual right, house. Right. That's right. Where? Uh, verse 14. I will be his father, and he shall be my son. If he commit iniquity, I will chasten him with the rod of men and with the stripes of the children of men. Right, so uh, Solomon committed iniquity, but is there anywhere in, in the history of kings that Solomon got punished with the rod of men? Who got punished with the rod of men? Yeah, I will show you. know? Okay, so that, that's how that's when he got that's when he got his judgment. And Cain righteous as your house shot. He he did no doubt. But you still have to talk with him other past lives. That's why you have other people still born and not it because what they did in the past lives. And the Hebrews uh, chapter seven. Yeah. This is Hebrews chapter seven, and I'll start at uh I'll start at verse twenty-two. By such by so much was Yahweh made a surety of a better testament. And they truly were many priests, because they were not suffered to continue by reason of death. But but this man, because he continueth forever, hath an unchangeable priesthood. Wherefore he is able also to save them to the uttermost that come unto the most high by him, seeing he liveth, seeing he ever liveth to make intercession for them. Right. That's, that was his job, man, to, to make intercession to die and take over the sins from the nation of history. And he, and he said he was going to establish the Howard Shot forever, man, on the throne. Go ahead. But such an but such an priest became us who was holy, harmless, undefiled, separate from sinners, and made higher than the heavens. Right, so like was actually good. He needeth not daily as those high priests to offer up sacrifice first for his